So this is the application it's loading already. Please wait. Okay, now you see with this application I've created three videos on type two and type three and one with just one graphic plot. Now what do you do? You want to create video. Just click on create video. You wait for it to load. Now there are things you need to understand. You see this place showing a chair, a table with let's just say full stores on it. Now it's saying that's the environment it is right now. And if you check down here, it's showing TV so far, no actor. What does that mean? Now, click on TV so far. Your home may be showing no, nothing, you know. It might be showing all sorts of stuff. But what, what, what you need is, now, you see, I have a lot of environments here that I can use, like, a lot. You see, you can just pick one, you download it, there are ones you are going to pay for, you know. You can just pick any one you want. Let our, let me choose one, it's need bedroom, conversion. Oh, I'm coming, I'm coming, I'm coming. Now, I'm trying to download this. A holiday. Now, it has downloaded. Now you see. That's the environment. Now, a street corner rainbow. I just download that. Now, you have to pick an actor you want to use. You see all of this? God. You can only buy most of them. But at least, there are some you can use without buying. Let's see. Now, I have this guy. I have Lizzie. You see? You can download this. But, you know, let's just use free one. Uh, left door, left bench. Now he's sitting on the bench. Let's pick another actor. We need a male actor. Okay, let's pick Sam, Sammy or Scott. Let's just take Scott. Now, bench as well. Oh, no, the two cannot be sitting on the bench. So, sorry. Now, you see the two of them are standing together, showing that they are, you, know, you understand, they are talking. Now, I've chosen the environment I want, uh, I've chosen the character that I want. You see the other time, a lot of characters there. So, once you just do that, then you are good to go. Now, let me explain to you the environment of this application. Underneath, uh, where I have my street corner in Bolivia and Scott, there are six icons there. What does this icon mean? The first one is showing that if you want to add another thing to your, you know, animation, maybe, you know, they are just talking and after they talk, you want them to appear in another thing like, okay. But what you need to know is that this thing must be correlating. One must not be showing a bedroom and the other one is showing a field. You know, you just have to let them correlate, like, okay, well, this is what they are trying to sh tell us. That's the first one is picking a scene. Now, take a look at it. Now it's showing a scene. You click on the scene. It brings you here. So, I don't need a scene for now. So, now, let me just remove it. The second one is telling you you want to start your story. You know all the talks and the now it's no actor. The other time, don't forget, I speak Lizzie and Scott. Now, who do I want to speak for? You know, on a normal day, a guy will speak if you just meet a lady or you know, normal, normal. Now, this place you just write a dialogue. Dialogue means your text, what you want them to speak. And actually, you can use voice chat, uh, voice record. If you want to use your voice, but the guy will be speaking everything you see. Now, hello, Lizzie. You see this? Besides Scott's name, I am seeing something 
neutral. What does that mean? Just click on it. It shows all kind of gesture you want the guy to make, you know. Hello, Lizzie. What do you want him to do? You know. Let's just pick one. Uh, okay. Let's pick happy. Yeah. That's it. Hello, Lizzie. Now, there's a video uh, icon here. Yeah. The video icon is actually in point that if you want to play your video, just click on it. Hello, Lizzie. Do you see that? Now. That is the function of the second icon there. The third uh, icon on the uh, here is, you know, there are some special gestures that, you know, maybe between a guy and a girl that is dating. There are some things that you can do, crazy, crazy things. Now, let's just try and use it and see what it does. Now, after I click the third icon, it's bringing this no actor asking me to choose uh, who I want to make the gesture now, Scott as well. Add on what do you want, uh, Scott to do now? We have Kiras, Eskimo keys, first stroke, and shake, i5, org, keys, keys rejected, keys shy, you know, and stuff. But now, what do I want to do? Org, no, 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 not keys, org, yeah. You see, it's showing Scott all the users. So, that's that about the third icon. And the fourth one is showing a notification. Let's see. A sound. Oh, sorry. Well, that's just about that. And the third, uh, the fourth, sorry, the fifth one is like if you want to add the music to what uh, people are doing there. Now, I have this music here, and if you have, uh, if you want to get more music, click down one. So I have up here. No, sorry, sorry, sorry. Up here. And that's it. And when that thing is showing and they are talking, that music will be playing silently underneath. So that's it about that. And the last one, if you just want to add the text to the stuff that they are doing, you know, but the text will show on the screen, removing the environment you had to it. I think you are getting me. Now, let's just make um, a lot of, what is it called, a lot of text to make the video. What was this doing? Oh, sorry about that. I guess my network is kind of uh, okay, okay, okay. Let's forget that. Now this is how you are going to be making the 